Hey everybody, this is Julie with ReadySitStampIt.blogspot.com, and I am going to put together one of these card kits that I got from my trip when I was in London. And I'm just kind of feeling in a really youthful mood, so I figured I will just start working on these cards. And this is already pre-cut. It came like this. This is just a pre-cut frame, and I wanted a fun card that was going to be quick and easy and super cute. So while I'm doing this card, I'll explain a little bit about the card, but I'm going to explain while I'm feeling like I need to do a little girly card. So I'm at the house today and my stepdaughter's here and she has her friend and, and I'm also going to put this one here. I'll talk and, and do the same thing at the same time for you guys. So she's with her friend and her friend tells me that she has this gal that cuts her hair really nicely and she comes into your home and does such a great job and you know I have to say her hair her friend's hair did look really pretty and she said so she'll be sending you a card because uh, I told her about you and she was looking for new customers and you know she does a really good job at old people's hair too ah I just about died I was like oh you know what do you say to that thank you so, anyway, I, I, you know, I just have to take into account that she's 17 years old, and of course, a 38-year-old's going to sound old, so. Nonetheless, you guys, um, I'm doing something youthful, so I can, like, go back in my youth real quick somehow. Uh, let's see here. So, the next thing we're going to do is add some pop dots to the back of this circle. Let's see here. And this here, I thought this would be really cute. I've been kind of playing with this card to see exactly how I want to lay it out and just want something different here. So let's put this here, this here, and I'm going to put this one up higher intentionally. I'm intentionally not centering this because I have a plan. I've got a plan of action here. Alright, so we'll put this one in the middle here. And I probably should find out exactly how much I need to space these out here before I just plop it down and not know. Um, that looks good right there. And then this one will go... Looks like I need to really put these close together on here to keep them centered properly. Put that one there. I like that one raised up a little bit. I think it looks cute. Add a little bit of tape here. Okay, there we go. I was missing you guys. I haven't been making cards for a couple of days. Although I did do, you should check out my blog. I did my first challenge, and so I posted it there. So if you guys want to see another card that I did, I did my very first challenge. I'm just excited because it's something new that I've never tried before, and I just kind of felt like I wanted to try something just different and exciting. So I'm going to add the stars here. I'm going to add three stars in the center of these right here. And add the star here. There we go. And on top of these stars, I have these little cute, cute pink hearts. If I can. Let me all hold that up so you guys can see that. There we go. And I'll probably edit this. You guys don't have to see me put all the stars and all the hearts down. You'd probably be like, okay, we get that part. We get it. Okay, so there's the little heart in there. Isn't that cute? You know, at first when I saw that, I thought that was a bra. But it's not. It's a purse. So let's hope somebody else doesn't confuse that, right? Okay, so I went ahead and did both sides here. You guys can see that. Isn't that coming out cute? And one of two things, I was debating on which ribbon I want to use. So this is a really skinny grow grain ribbon. And I thought a cute way of tying this would be to, let me back this out just a little bit more so you guys can see what I'm doing here. Kind of put this under here like so. And bring it through here. And then pull it back around this way. Just for a different look on the card. Oops, scoot that down. I don't mean to keep that up so high. But just for kind of a different look on the card, a different tie. But then I remembered I had this really fun, fluffy, wired ribbon, or what do you call it, funky fiber, I would call it. 
and I really like this. So I went with this instead. So I was just showing you guys a couple different ways of finishing this off. And I just wrapped it around this piece of silver cardstock. And we're going to tape it down here like so. Just love how this card is turning out. It's so cute. Bringing me back to my youth. That's what I need, guys, right? That's what I need. Okay, and then these were really cute little sayings from the Heidi Grace store. And I don't actually think this is from her line, but um, she had them and she was selling them. And they're really cute. So that says thanks there. And I'm do going to do one more thing to finish this card off because I thought these would be adorable. And I have these cute little bows. They're just these little silver bows here, and I thought they'd be really cute to add that right there. And then one more little silver bow over here, like that. How cute, right guys? So cute. There you go. I'm 17 again. <laughs> don't I wish. Actually, I probably don't wish to be 17. I like being an adult and doing my own things, and I don't mind bills when I'm an adult. Okay, so that's it guys. I hope you enjoy it. And let me get this a little closer so you can see it. There we go. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Have a terrific, terrific day. Bye-bye.